Hello, my name is Ryan Beardall. In this video, you'll learn how to use the Dentrix Search Payments feature to quickly locate past payments. This feature is available in Dentrix G4 and later, and it is available here in the ledger under the File menu, and you choose Search Payments. Now in this resulting dialog, we have a lot of different options that you can use individually or you can combine to try and find the payments you're looking for such as the check number or bank branch number, the insurance, and we can choose between dental, medical, and specific carriers or range of carriers, the payment types. You can select a date or a range of dates, and you can choose between if entry date or procedure date. You can pick an amount or a range of amounts, and you can search by specific guarantors. So let's begin with an example. I found an old check. I know the check number. I'll type that in. I want to see if it was deposited on anyone's account. And I click search. In just a moment here, it goes through all the payments in all date ranges, and there's my result. Now if I double click on this name, it actually loads that patient's ledger so I can view details. But let's clear that, and let's try a different search. This time I'm going to look for a specific payment type and then a specific amount of money. I'm going to match two different criteria, and then that list will be narrowed down by people who have payments that match those results. Here we search, and there they are. And once again, I can double-click that name. It opens that patient's ledger, and I can dig into more detailed information about them. Let me give you one more example here. This time I'm going to go way back. November of 2001. So I'll put that in as a date range, November 1 to November 30th. You can also click the pull down arrow there and I could have a calendar. And I'll look for $100 to $200. Any payments between that amount of money in the month of November 2001 and here's my list. Now here at the bottom I do have another feature here to print that. So let's bring up the print options. And then I will check Print Preview so that you can see this here on the screen with me. And here comes the results. Fairly simple report. You'll see first we have a cover page. And then if I move up to the next page there, there is my list of the matches for those payment types. And that's how Dentrix does it. For more tips and tricks on Dentrix, be sure to visit the Online Resource Center.